So hello guys welcome back to the channel I hope you all are absolutely fine and sound and in this video I'm going to talk about the Google Cloud Arcade Facilitator Cohort 2 selection image which was sent earlier. So first of all if you're new to this channel like the video and subscribe to the channel. So basically for becoming a facilitator we have to fill a form and in case you haven't filled the form and what is the details basically you can just come over the channel and just start type how to become a facilitator so here basically i have already uploaded the video one month ago so many of you have filled the form and many of you have got selected also and some of you have not got selected so here in this video i'm going to talk about the selected participants only and i will deal with the non-selected participants also basically this is for facilitators for participants as you can see over here the form will be live on 4th of august 2025 around 5 pm don't worry i will share every details regarding the form how to fill the form what will be the next criteria all things will be covered in this channel no need to worry about it now the next thing over here is that the arcade facilitator form basically the shortlisted form people who were shortlisted to become the facilitator emails were out so here i have already uploaded a video you must have watched you are in cohort 2 facilitator selection emails are out so basically here i have shared all the step-by-step -step guide how you can fill the form submit the form and the most important thing is that what are the steps what are the requirements how to make a cloud community account how to share your linkedin account what we have to share how to create your id proof all things are covered over here over here so in case you haven't watched the video watch it i will link the video in the description now i'm talking about the important thing that the deadline is approaching for this form so if you have received the form then you have time till 28th of july yes you heard it right you have 20 time till 28th of july if you haven't filled the form yet do fill it and just complete it if you need the guidance you can just watch the video in the description below now one more important thing is that many of you haven't received this email and some of you are very sad due to it so no need to worry basically generally in cohort 2 they generally select less or no participants based on new basically new participants they rarely select in second cohort so what you can do you can wait and participate as a participant and and the next cohort basically in the 2026 you can just apply as a facilitator i'll guide you again no need to worry about it this is just based on luck and no need to worry in the first cohort of 2026 you will surely get selected now here regarding the cohort 2 for the participants not for the facilitators for facilitators hurry up fill the form i have uploaded the guide you can watch in the description for participants some important things you need to take care of that the cohort 4 will sorry cohort 2 will be starting on 4th of august 2025 around 5 pm so basically the registration form will be shared only at that time it will be uploaded over here and the enroll section will be available also i will make a video and share how you have to fill the form so no need to worry about it now some of you have queries that we have started doing the games in the july itself and can we do the skill badges also so here we'll cover this also so basically you can complete the july games all will be counted in the arcade program okay in, in in the arcade program also for the skill badges you can complete the skill badges two skill badges give one arcade point you can complete that also the it will also give you two skill badge one arcade point but the problem is here for the arcade facilitator program you need to make sure for the arcade facilitator program participants will be getting only bonus points and facilitators will be getting rewards so don't first confusion is this only there is no special rewards for the arcade facilitator program for the participants participants means who will enroll and complete the skill badges and facilitators means who will be guiding like sharing solutions assisting you in public profile correcting your details etc will be assisting you throughout this cohort basically from 4th of august to 6th of october now here basically for the participants if you complete suppose skill badges before the 4th of august before the enrollment is successful then you will get the point but chances are there we are expecting some kind of challenges like earlier it was pre in previous year two skill badges instead of two skill badges one skill badge gave one point so you need to take care of it and i will recommend only do the july games and for the arcade game basically for the august game which you can see over here the cohort 2 
यू कैन स्टार्ट डूइंग स्किल बाजेज फ्रॉम फोर्थ ऑफ अगस्ट टिल सिक्स ऑफ अक्टूबर बेसिकली स्किल बाजेज फॉर द बोनस पॉइंट एलिजिबिलिटी देर इज वन मोर कंपनीजन दैट इफ यू डू स्किल बाजेज इट विल काउंटेड एज नॉर्मल आर्के पॉइंट बट इफ यू डू द स्किल बाजेज इन द फैसिलिटेटर कोहट इट बी काउंटेड एज स्पेशल बोनस पॉइंट दैट मीन्स इफ यू कंप्लीट दिस skill badges you will be rewarded some kind of bonus point so currently i think the syllabus has not been finalized okay so the syllabus has been finalized i think yes here is the syllabus you can see so i think there is some um, yes they are still finalizing the syllabus and the point system okay okay the syllabus has been updated so basically here you can see they have updated the syllabus so you can complete any six arcade games five trivia games and 14 skill badges any of the six pre provided lafri courses so here you can see for the six game there are six point five trivia games five points and 14 skill badges same points so if you complete these things you'll be getting two bonus point similarly for milestone 2 Eight arcade games will give eight points, and six trivia games will give six points, and twenty-eight skill badges will give fourteen points. So currently, they haven't revealed any kind of challenge. So chances are there it may happen the challenge or not. But the problem syllabus has been updated, so we'll be getting eight bonus points. Okay, so instead of twenty-eight bonus points, twenty-eight arcade points, you'll we'll getting eight bonus points. Okay, now some of you have confusions over it that if you complete milestone one and two. will you get both points so the answer is simple no the answer is simple you won't be able to get 10 points you'll get only get the higher milestone so for example if you are in ultimate milestone you will get only 25 bonus points not 8 to and 15 etc all much so you need to take care about it and that's all about it a uh, a a detailed video will come regarding all the queries which you are having and how to participate in the arcade facilitator program how to fill the first arcade participant basically the facilitator participant form and how the journey will be there where will be the skill badge list and how you can complete the games all things will be covered so that's all about this video if you like the video like the channel and subscribe the channel too apart from this if you are playing arcade games basically for the july games complete solution guide is here you can watch it and if you haven't claim your prizes claim it for cohort 1 because the program will be the form will be closed soon so also claim the swags also that's all for today thank you guys have a great day